I kind of feel like my mom got cheated. Team 10 is learning new details tonight after a family of eight says they're being evicted from a North County vacation rental. Troubleshooter Kristen Severance talked to the property manager who said it is actually the family who's causing the problems and the HOA Kristen telling a much different story. Yeah, a member of the HOA board contacted me and said there have been zero complaints about this family. She said the property manager was misrepresenting himself in this home away ad as the owner of the unit while the property manager still sticks by his statement that the family is to blame. I kind of feel like my mom got cheated. Okay. The Hawkins kids age 1 to 21 did not expect that. <laughs> couldn't wait for their San Diego vacation. Then they got here. It didn't really look like it slept 7. Like it said on the ad on Home Away. It said that it was family friendly, but it wasn't. The smoke detectors were missing. When I first looked up, I said, OK, this is crazy. This outlet exposed. He shocked himself and it hurt. And the screen broken. <laughs> he almost fell out. Mom Rachel paid $6,000 for 40 days in the Carlsbad condo. When she complained, there was this list of growing things. That property kept. manager Ryan Dans refunded the cleaning fee, bought a microwave for the one that broke and some bedding for the kids. Isn't enough. Then he said there had been complaints about the family, threatened eviction and called police. Um, the worst part I would say would be seeing my mom melt down and be afraid. The cops came the second time. Um, they were pounding on the doors and the windows. It ruins the whole coming to California with the family kind of thing. Dan's said the family violated the terms by having eight people instead of seven. But Rachel showed us this receipt of payment that clearly lists she's bringing eight. Then Dan's said in an email to Team 10, the family may have tampered with the smoke detectors. We're not tall enough to reach. And my dad's head doesn't even touch. An HOA board member contacted Team 10, saying Dan's is not the owner of the unit as listed on the ad. She also said there were no complaints to the HOA about the family. He continues to say that there have been a multitude of complaints about you. What do you say to that? Well, OK, show them to me. Hawkins hired attorney Edwin Schwartz. He said with vacation rentals exploding, so will issues like this. We really encourage the websites that put these parties together to have a better mechanism in place to resolve the disputes. The family is here from Colorado. They just sold their home. They took this vacation while waiting to close on their new place, so they can't drive back to Colorado if they get kicked out. No more rentals. I'm still waiting to talk to the actual owner of the unit. All right, Kristen, thank you.